average function and two sister functions which are median and mode and I want to bring these functions uh, and show you the differences because these are really helpful for analysis and it's important to understand what you're calculating so I have this dummy information here for like 32 employees and some dummy salary information but you know we can see that we have some employees that are making a lot of money like 320,000 200 120 but then there's a lot of employees that are making like 15 22 32 and then some that are like 78 and so on and you want to calculate let's say an average an average it's really an arithmetic mean um, or average so whenever someone says a mean arithmetic means seems this it's the same as saying an average so that's when we think about it you're always taking the uh, adding up all the numbers and then dividing by the the, um, the numbers that we have the the data sets that we have so you know here in our case we would say average and we would specify you know select here the range right there and I'm going to also use the absolute reference so I can copy it down um, f function f4 and then close parenthesis and here you go and so in our case we have that the average salary for this set of employees in this company in this dummy company it's 60,000 which is okay it's not bad but is it really true truly telling us everything I mean some of these big numbers like the 320 200 and 120 there's like that's a multiple of some of these small salaries so they're very they're skewing it for us to higher number so we can use median which is basically finding a point in the middle um, of your data set so if I put median wow the median which is the middle if you if you order the the data points that you have the salary information from the highest to the lowest like you will find the medium volume so it's going to be going from you know 320,000 to I think the lowest we have like 15,000 or something so you will just find the medium the middle value in the set so the median is 32,000 so that's half of what we're thinking almost half of um you know when we think about an average now you can also use a mode which is another calculation of finding the value in your list that most frequently is found so it's finding which salary is more frequently found in your data set and the most frequent salary is 22,000 it's not the 320 which was the one salary the 200 was one time 120 is another one time but we have a lot of employees who are actually making 22,000 that's the most frequent salary so now you see based on just using these three formulas together we can tell the difference really about our data just using the average it's not necessarily what you want to do because it's skewing it towards either the very small or the very high so if you have a lot of data in the middle but you have certain data points that are at the very top or very bottom they can skew your average so you want to be aware of that when you're using these functions thanks so much for watching <music>